Sarah, thank you for that. I just sent Justin a text. I put my order in for a case of Shiraz <laughs> coming back. All right, Justin? I'll take care of the VAT when you get home. Don't worry about it. Um, we have a, as we start 2018 here on Tennis Channel, we have a new acronym that we're all going to get used to, one that we all hope becomes very much a part of the staple of the tennis world, UTR, Universal Tennis Ratings. I've been getting used to it for a while now because my son playing in the juniors and then of course in college and the juniors use it extensively they always want to know what their UTR is and if I win this match where will I go and my opponent is ranked because you go up and down according to the matches that you win the matches that you lose and of course it's the, the most 30 most recent matches that you play and for college Ted you know it's these kids, they know where they need to get to in order to get to specific colleges, whether it's D1, D3. So, Tracy, you've been doing this 25 years with me. Explain this to me. as a, in, a, in, in simple English, what does UTR tell me in, like, two sentences? Yeah, there's one standard across the world, globally. And so you put your 30 matches in, I put my last 30, you put your last 30, and it'll come out, it'll spit at Yo Novak Djokovic, uh, Nadal, they're about 16. And uh, someone that's going to a D1 college, they'll be somewhere like 12 or 13, something like that. And so that's what they're looking for. And this is wonderful because if you're a, a club player and you're a 7 and I go to Italy and I show up at a club, I ask, can I play a 7 as well? So it doesn't matter what gender, it doesn't matter you know, what age, it's just that you, everybody can play at the same level. So Kiki Mladenovic doesn't have a great UTR right now. <laughs> Still better than most in the world, though, right? Well, Don Knowles in mid-season four. Uh, and He's so, taking a beating. And so Come on, I, Kiki. What I understand, too, is that, for example, we'll, we'll take a look at the professional ranking, the tour ranking. It's just wins and losses, right? That's how your ranking's determined, whereas UTR takes into account who you beat. Yes, and how score. You, how also you beat. margin yes. of victory exactly. so right. far. So you get some points right. for close losses, which is nice. Yes, so 7-6, seven, 7-6 six, seven, six loss still is very valuable. Love and love loss is uh, going to be uh, you know, going to push you down. And so the fascinating part is we're, we're getting used to this too and we're going to look ahead. Even for example the match we're going to see shortly here Donald Young and Jao Sosa, they're rank on the 52 week ATP very close. Very close. Big gap though in the UTR. So I'm fascinated to see how quickly we can all, I mean, there it is, you see the gap. And there are only four ranking spots apart right now on the ATP Tour ranking. Yeah, I'm fascinated with that. And it's, it's been interesting in the juniors and in the pros, Ted, to watch this because, or the college, I should say, because so often they get it right. I mean, they're really spot on. Very interesting. What's Brandon Holt's UTR? Something, <laughs> gosh, I don't, I think he's Brandon would not hesitate. something. He would not hesitate. He would know that. Would yeah. <laughs> I don't follow it that well. It's better just to try to win. Win your matches. It'll take care of itself. Does that give the college players one more thing to think of, pressure-wise, or are they okay with it? You know, I never talk about it with Brandon, but, I mean, that's how they do the rankings, and that's how they get into tournaments, and that's how they, they use it so often. And, again, for kids to get into colleges, the college coaches, they're using it. So that's what's most important. They're checking it out. So there's Zhao Sosa. This is Portuguese Zhao, who played in the finals of this event last year. Donald Young, stay with us. Live tennis from Auckland, New Zealand, coming up next on Tennis Channel.